today so we're taking the bus and I decided we'll take the Greyhound. It's kind of iconic American bus service. You gotta get yourself to the uh, the bus line, which I don't really know where it is, and I'm in meant to be in Port Authority, which is where I am, but I'm trying to find the gates now. A little bit lost. We're on the Greyhound bus. It's quite nice, yeah. quite modern-ish, been redone. But we've got pizza. It's a two and a half hour bus ride, so go need some pizza. <laughs> That's like if you want to I also have got the microphone, so audio is going to be shit all weekend. I can't go anywhere without basically falling asleep on a bus. So I've had a little bit of a nap. Somebody hasn't. They're wanting to. We've about an hour left till we get there. The reason I'm going to uh, Atlantic City this weekend is it's Steve Marr and a guy at work's stag do. Well, it's a fake stag do. In fact, it's no longer a stag do because a load of other people are coming along now. Uh, so it's called the Steve Mon Bash. Bringing the baby mama along to, you know, keep an eye on her. We have an express bus, which means it's not stopping at our hotel. It's going to stop at two others, and then we have to walk back. We're literally right outside our hotel now. This is silly. It's not exactly Vegas. It's not even like Coney Island. Ooh, made it to the hotel. Sad to go a bit of a walk. That might have been a mistake for somebody, but it's quite nice in here. Big, got a bed each. <laughs> All bed to myself for no. the weekend. No. It's nice, it's bright, spacious, it's a good room. I like this here. So far, we're up $7, we're winning. We're gonna drop some bits and pieces off and then come for some food. We're gonna to go to a British pub because I really, really fancy. Something like Bangers and Mash or something like that. There's a Gordon Ramsay restaurant, so we're gonna try that. And then we're gonna meet up with everyone else later on the night for some Wild West casino fun. Key thing, we're $7 up. Baby mama needed some sleep, so I took a little bit of a nap. And now we're gonna go play with the adults, aren't we? and we're going to have something to eat and then we're going next door to this Wild West place. Um, no idea. Now we're just going to go find Pan and the gang. from clubbing that was an experience and we're starving so we thought we'd decide to order room service this is the size of the pizza wow this is a big ass pizza can't complain about the portion size good up and rested and now we're going to go to land shop for some grub meet the rest of the team just got to meet them at Kwai restaurant um, gonna take a little walk down the Broadway boardwalk and chill out and then gamble and then we're going to a pool party so that'll be fun or messy again all of this can't be filmed because it gets messy <laughs> So this is the boardwalk and we've got casinos and restaurants and food he want to be in it. and we've got Pan who is trying to he run away from it. it. Where is he? There he is. There's Pan. Pan you made the vlog. Well done. Um, so we're going to go get that food now from Landshark. It's alright. It's just a bit rainy and 
gloomy today. It's nice to go and see the area, and there's a beach. That was an absolute disaster. Food never turned up, drinks were wrong, and cancelled my order in the end because it was terrible. Hey Jazz, you ate the vlog. <laughs> so I abandoned my order, everyone else is a bit hungry and stuff, so I'm gonna get some more food as well. Yeah, their own lives. Damn, I look good. Do you? You look smudgy. It's wet and cold today, and Melissa decided to wear skirt and it's now absolutely freezing to death she got a 10 minute walk until we get back to the room she thought it was going to be sunny and on the beach and all wonderful she was wrong in the afternoon of taking easy chilling out in the hotel and now going to harris for a after dark pool party um just a jacuzzi hot tub thing we're going to enjoy vip service should get messy and dirty so probably not going to be able to film most of this either um, I'll just tell you how it was afterwards. This is Harris. Very different to Caesars. One, One thing different is in the hotels in Vegas is they all smell nice as you walk in. Really looking forward to the pool party. Uh, spent millions on it having been redone. So we've got a jacuzzi, so we got a drink and chill out. It'll be a nice evening. Had a burger at the bar. Very good, very nice. Uh, got a bit of time to kill, so go gambling. That's what you do here, really. Just gamble. We're in the pool party. We've got our own cabana. Woo! Oh, and free drink. It's a good drink. And now we've got a jacuzzi to go to. my neck like that's the limited movement at the moment we're gonna go check out and I'm gonna go down and meet with Pan and Steve Mon for some brunch and then take our bus back I have to take some drugs this is ridiculous I mean this is basically that to dress me that's embarrassing <laughs> Figuring out how everyone's going to get home. Some people are taking buses, some people are driving. Some people are just staring into the camera, aren't they? Just gossiping away. We're in an Italian restaurant for brunch, and there's this creepy thing here. That's scary to have in your table. On the bus now, I'm going back into New York. It's an express to Port Authority. Great, that's good. I quite like it. Comfortable seats, lots of leg room. Air conditioning, free Wi-Fi and electric. Past the halfway mark now, less than an hour until New York. It's a quiet ride. I'm probably the loudest one here doing this. Seriously, it's like look at her. She could be dead. talking about a potential family car and I think this is the perfect car. Not that, that's a taxi. Look at that. 